Hey, I'm Mike with the Florida Public Archaeology Network, and today I'm inside our public archaeology lab to reveal the artifact that we posted for our series called What Is It Wednesday? Now, if you guessed that the artifacts we posted were metallic tubes, then you would technically be correct. But if you guessed that the artifacts were friction primers, then you get bonus points because that is exactly what this particular artifact is. This is a replica of some of the friction primers that we posted on our Facebook page, but they would have worked in the exact same way. Friction primers were tubes, copper tubes like this, that were filled with a chemical compound uh, that would act as an ignition. Friction primers were basically fuses used to fire cannon. Once they had loaded the black powder and the cannon ball inside the cannon, they would then insert one of these friction primers inside the vent of the cannon. And when they were ready to fire it, instead of lighting it with fire, like they used to do in the colonial times, by the 19th century, by using these friction primers, they'd simply attach a lanyard, which was a rope with a hook on one end, to the wire on the friction primer. And they were, when they were ready to fire, they'd simply pull the lanyard, which would pull the wire out of the copper tube that would then ignite a chemical compound within the copper tube that would then ignite the black powder within the cannon firing the projectile. Now this is an American style friction primer and the Americans started to use these in the mid 19th century. So uh, during the American Civil War, uh, they used friction primers like this to fire cannons.